how should I feel, Stu, about the Houston Astros? And I'm kind of gauging that, you know, the sense among baseballs that everybody, I don't want to say cheats, but everybody looks for advantages to a certain level and to a certain extent. But as soon as, as technology is involved, as soon as cameras are involved, like it, it just seems like it spoils what is such a good team. And I know they're in the AL West and I know we, we personally, <laughs> we're not fond of them covering the A's, but it kind of just taints everything. Well, let's look at it this way. I mean, they're a good baseball team. I mean, right. you look at their lineup, you look at the players that, that are in their everyday lineup, um, one through nine, um, they have a really, really respectable lineup. With that being said, I'm, I'm one of those guys that, I mean, if you're giving signals from second base, you know, I'm okay with that. Um, if their first base coach is stealing signals from the catcher, I'm okay with that. And, right. and third base, I'm okay with that. Um, you know, it, it makes me think back to the days when, at White Sox Stadium when they were using lights from the scoreboard to uh, to tell hitters what were what was coming, and then I mean, but now with today's technology, there's so many different ways for you to be able to steal signs and steal pitches. Um, so I guess it kind of reminds me of, of 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 the steroid era. You know, you got guys that were great players any within their own right, um, but you take it a little bit further um, by cheating. Um, so. For me, I mean, I think that there definitely needs to be something done about it. A message needs to be sent. Right. Um, but what that message is, um, I'm not sure yeah. um, what it should be um, and what degree of punishment it should be. Yeah, it's hard to punish somebody after the fact, and especially a team like that, which you know has won it all but also made some, some deep postseason runs. Is there a way for you to to know how much they gained from from the cheating, the you know the the trash can sound that would tell a batter if it's an off speed pitch or not is can you say it's like a five game advantage over 162 or a ten game advantage and I guess that's a pointed question because the A's only lost the West by six and ten games respectively each of the last two years. What I can tell you is this, um, and I know this from my own personal experience being on the bench and in the clubhouse. Um, we, the A's and we, the Blue Jays were the, probably the two clubs that, um, I played on, um, that were notorious for being able to steal signs and pick up little things and you pass them on to your teammates. Now, what I do know is this, sometimes your teammates want the information and sometimes you don't. Um, so it, even though they may have the information, there could have been, you know, a, 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 a bunch of guys that, that didn't want to know at all. Some right. guys don't want to know what's coming. Some It'll guys mess with you. Just, yeah. And so um, that's the the way I would look at it. I mean, it, it's it's really tough to say how many guys used it. Right. But I guess we go back to, to the, the real fact, which is they did it. They They relayed the information in the way that they did it and the way that they got it, and that makes it all bad. It's so hard to look at the video evidence, right? It's so clear yeah. to see, you know, when it's when it's presented in a fashion of, okay, here's example one, and two, and three, and four, and ten, and twenty, and like, there's, this is so blatant. Um, yeah, I do know that the commissioner's office is looking deeply into yeah. it, and, and I got that from some inside sources, Yeah, that they're really looking into this deeply, um, and when they do finally determine what the punishment is it is going to be um it's going to be stern it's going to be one that that uh that baseball will remember is wow. what i'm hearing 